Hey, I'm Tessa Commerce. I'm a pediatrician and I have a special interest in sexual health. I am the head of medical education for Julie. Today's questions are all from you and they're about Julie, the emergency contraception pill. Your first question is, does weight impact the efficacy of the morning after pill? The straightforward answer is yes. We know that as weight goes up, efficacy goes down, but it's safe for individuals of any weight to take the morning after pill. So here's an example. For individuals under a BMI of 25, if 100 women took the morning after pill, two might become pregnant. For individuals with a BMI over 30, we know that if 100 individuals took the morning after pill, six might become pregnant. But we do know that it's still effective. So if this form of emergency contraception is the only one available to you, it's definitely worth taking the morning after pill. Your next question is about abdominal discomfort many days after taking the morning after pill. We do know that short term, within the first 48 to 72 hours after taking the morning after pill, we can expect a variety of side effects like nausea, headaches, abdominal discomfort, and those should usually resolve after the first few days. Other side effects like spotting or period changes take a little bit longer to show up. But if a symptom like abdominal pain is lasting six days after taking the morning after pill, it's worth talking to a doctor, especially if you're having a hard time keeping food down or staying hydrated, or if the pain is very severe. It's possible that this is unrelated to the morning after pill at all, but it's worth checking in with a doctor. Your next question comes from someone who experienced an earlier period and a prolonged period after taking the morning after pill. And they're wondering, is this normal? In fact, it would technically be considered within the range of normal because bleeding changes are the most common side effect associated with the morning after pill. Heavier periods, a period that starts later than normal, and spotting after the, taking the pill are very common. So if you are experiencing a heavier period or if you're missing your period for a couple of months, it's worth talking to a doctor. Your last question is around safety if you have a history of a stroke. It is safe to take the morning after pill if you have a history of stroke or other clotting diseases. That's because the main ingredient, levonorgestrel, is a progestin derivative. And we do know that that type of hormone is safe for individuals who have that type of history. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you wanna learn more, follow along with us and hit the subscribe button. If you have a question for us, you can leave it in the comment section below. Thanks for watching.